guys happy Wednesday um I've already made this video once but the flip video recorder froze on me so here we go again but it's good because I practice and we can do it really quick today's inspiration for to do of the holidays is this lovely lady Misty Copeland she is a rare black dancer in the world of classical ballet and was featured in W Magazine. I picked this up yesterday and I thought she looked really, really cute. She has very, very long straight hair. So that's what we're going to do. Last night I washed my hair, surprise, surprise, for the first time in many, many days. <clears throat> and I actually washed it with a clarifying shampoo so it is as clean as it will get. Um, that would be takeout clarifying shampoo, a CB product. It got off, got out all of the dry shampoo and all of the gunk that had been in it and you know usually when you go to bed with your hair wet because I took a shower last night before bed you sleep on it it looks unless you're Zac Efron it's majorly bustled in the morning but I used ancient serum and I put it through and I combed it through and look how soft and shiny and it fell right to the way I'd like it now all we have to do is hit it with the fly and iron just a little bit and I'm going to use just a tiny the tiniest tiniest drop of ancient serum put it on here we're going to flat iron my hair first I've already thanks to flip video flat ironed all the extensions because you know my hair is not that long so flat iron one inch sections and just my hair straight but this is just getting it super straight My hair is getting long too, huh? Once we put the extensions in, we're going to flat iron again. So I'm not going to take too much time on each section. Just going to smooth it out. Okay. Bangs too. We want these bangs to be really straight. Thanksgiving's tomorrow. You guys excited? I am because I love food. And family. Mostly food. Let's do this. Must have hairstyling do with the day tool if you're keeping track. Rat tail comb. I got a new one yesterday, it's fresh. Another must have sectioning clips. These are new too. All very affordable. This comb was $3. It's priceless. And I'm also playing with the Denman brush today, which is a soft kind of bore brussel brush, which is good for brushing out long hair. So there we are. My hair's flat. I'm going to take the sectioning comb, section around the crown, and pull it up because that's where we're going to put the first track. Right there. piece of hair. Let's give it another quick. This is real human hair in these extensions. They're considerably more expensive than synthetic hair, but you can't use heat or styling products on synthetic hair and at the end of the day it looks fake. So if you can save up, I would recommend getting extensions made with real human hair and they last. I've had these for three years. There you go. Now let's take this up though. This up. Here. Clip it. 
we're going to section again. Not right underneath because you want some of your real hair to fall in between. One thing that is a little challenging about really, really clean hair is that when it's really, really clean, it's very slippy and shiny. When it has a little gunk in it, it holds things like clips and curl better. So, it's that. Another advantage of real human extensions is you can dye them. You can do anything to real human extensions that you can do to real human hair. So there, that's a good start, but we need to, what they call is overtake these parts. So it doesn't look like I just have these two big long pieces. We're going to do that with the individual ones, but I'm going to put this up here so I'll know what I'm working with. So I'm going to clip one here. These have wig clips on the opposite ends. Originally these were all just different tracks, like the long one, but Sharon cut them into pieces to use them for my wedding hairdo. They're actually pretty convenient that way. And then we're going to do under the underside with the foot last two. Actually, I have three. my hair in with it. I could probably use some more pieces. Let's take all this down. See what we're working with. Does that look believable yet? So now if you're getting real ex like extensions fused into your hair, this guy needs to be fixed because he's hanging out. Um, they would or they could cut your hair around it so like cut the extension into the hair so it looks like you've got um, layers hmm now this is this done brush with the bristles it's nice and soft and it doesn't pull too hard as to like rip the extensions out but it smooths them. So let's take some hair up here and flat iron it with my hair. We're gonna prep it with faux finish. Did I say you can use products on fake hair too? And heat. So how's that look, kids? Hmm. Another way to pull it off now that we've had it down, it still kind of looks like I don't have enough, is to put it in a ponytail. Nobody can ever tell if it's in a ponytail. But you can make a really nice updo. Or we can do side ponytails. Or you could just rock it and wear it straight. Which is what I think I'm gonna do. Let's brush it again. I don't think Mrs. Preston's gonna know this. Well she'll know my hair isn't this long, but she'll be like It's all in good fun. Good thing I'm not wearing any ballerina shoes. So, Cebu loves you. Oh, let me show you something. This is what I'm bringing on my trip. 
since I do have to do a do of the day for you on Friday, which will be very cute, to bring all of my supplies. Look, it's Cebu Shopping Tote. Mm -hmm. I got it free, and you can too. $25 purchase. Just get it on the promotions page, put it into your bag, look, and it folds up into this cute little pouch that says Cebu on it. Makes a cute camera case. Whatever. And don't forget, Cebu Cyber Monday is this Monday, November 30th. Free shipping all day long, no minimum order, and free Cebu gift wrap portfolio with every single purchase. So, have a happy Thanksgiving. Be safe. Say hi to your friends and family for me. Tell them to watch Cebu do the holidays and Cebu.